What's up guys, this is Dobby, and these are my top 5 tips for taming on Atlas. Tip number 1, having taming proficiency perks. Here I'm going to show you the differences between having proficiency perks and not having proficiency perks. Differences that you'll notice is the effectiveness overall, and also towards the percentage you get each feed on taming. Having these proficiency perks will give you plus 15 to 45% more taming affinity, which is going to help your overall taming effectiveness and help you get the tame done quicker. Tip number two, bring extra bolas. You don't want to show up to a creature with 10 bolas thinking that's going to be exactly what you need and accidentally miss a bola. Missing that bola is going to make you miss your feed. You're going to have to struggle to get more bolas which is gonna mess up your taming affinity overall. You're gonna have to like ask your friend to go make you some more bolas while you're in the middle of this tame and that's gonna cause you to mess up overall. You just bring the extra bolas. It's, it doesn't take that long to make them. You're, it's gonna save you time in the long run. Tip number three, gates are your friend. I know they're not the cheapest things, but they're not that expensive. Take the time. If you're going to be taming multiple creatures, try to set up a place where you can tame. Uh, over here in the desert, we've got ourselves a taming pen that we use specifically for rhinos and giraffes. We get them in the smaller trap, but in the small trap, we've got basically what we think of as a larger trap of gates surrounding the area. So that way, if we're trying to tame a rhino, other rhinos aren't trying to come over and kill us and attack us. Uh, giraffes won't be able to attack us while we're taming the one giraffe in the middle. It helps overall, gives you a safe workplace. It's really good. Make the large gates, build them around your trap. Tip number four, use the best food option available. Using the best food option available kind of ties in a little bit with the taming proficiency. It's going to increase the percentage you get every feed. So your tame will get done quicker. It'll help with keeping that at effectiveness high so you're getting closer towards 100% effectiveness not 80% effectiveness to where you're losing levels. Tip number five, bring a friend or get some help from a stranger. I was in the middle of a tame once where I had to ask my buddy to run over make some more bolas and get them to me. It worked, he got them to me in time but it could have turned out bad. If he didn't get them to me in time, I could have lost the taming effectiveness, I could have lost time on the tame, I could have went from 90% to 50% because we didn't get him fed in time. Make sure you follow the tips because if you don't do these things, if you don't over prepare, it's going to cost you. Alright guys, that's going to wrap things up for the top 5 tips to taming on Atlas. If you guys like this video, hit that like button. Also, feel free to drop a comment down below, let me know what you think, or if you have any questions. Also down there in the description, there's a link to my Twitch, and I stream every day, it's awesome, come check me out. Also, if you ever want to talk, I got a Discord down there too.